Hi, I'm professional angler Chad Morgan Taylor, and I want to take just a minute and show you some of the ways that I fish and rig my frogs. One of the most exciting ways to fish, and one of my favorite frogs to fish is a hollow body frog. And some of the things whenever you're picking out a, a, a good hollow bodied frog is to make sure it's got a good soft body on it, really big wide gap hooks, okay? That's really important for your bite catch ratio. And whenever you tie it on, always use braided line so that you don't have any stretch. It's a top water lure. It doesn't make any difference, trust me. Unless you use something different, it has too much stretch, you won't catch nothing but a cold. Okay? You always tie the frog with a loop knot. This will, whenever, what this does is whenever you work the frog slowly, it allows it to corner in place, back and forth, without moving it forward. And when you work it real fast with twitch motions, it doesn't make any difference because the frog will just nibble across the top of the water. Always use a, a 7 6 or the longest rod possible. I use a 7 6 heavy action so that you can make long casts and you can handle the fish and get good hook sets. A high speed reel is essential as well so that you can take up that line once that frog, once that fish bites that frog, you need to let him take it down, give him a few seconds, reel up the slack line, and give him a hook set. Now whenever I'm covering a lot of water, I like to use something like this El Grande Sapo Frog. It's a reeling frog, and I rig it with a 5 aught owner hook, a round bin hook. I get my best bite catch ratios doing that. I'll use this frog on conditions where it's cloudy or a little bit windy because it has its paddle feet. It stirs up a little noise, works really good through vegetation. Now whenever it gets slick, out, there's no wind, no disturbance on the water, and I'd need a little bit more subtle bait. That's when I turn to the Zoom Horny Toad. Same thing, cover a lot of water with this frog, reel it real fast. It's some great fishing. So try these rigging tips and these baits under those conditions, and I hope you catch a lot more fish.